In this video, we'll show you how you can auto update execution status based on the test step status, leading to more accurate real time reporting for managers and other interested stakeholders. In Zephyr, when we're executing a test case, we need to update the status of the test, but also the status of the steps. This can be managed by executing a step and using the prompt to then execute the test case or change the status of the test case, um, which can be a little bit annoying if you are a manual tester. To avoid this, we can click on auto update execution status based on test step status. This is configured in the administration section and in the project setup. So by clicking this and saving our change, you can now go back to the execution So if I navigate to my test, kick off an execution, we'll see now the status of the test case is updating automatically to work in progress. If I block or fail a test, the status will have auto update to blocked or failed. This allows for real-time reporting. So if a manager is running a report, there's no dependency to have to update the execution status in Zephyr. Hope you like this video. Uh, be sure to check out that feature and give it a try.